Well, welcome back to the channel, everybody. Um, today I'm talking about positive grounded equipment, tractors, trucks, the old trucks back in the uh, 30s, 40s, 50s, uh, were all positive ground. This is a 1944 John Deere D. It is a positive ground tractor. And I oftentimes see people asking questions. How do you hook the jumper cables up? How do you hook a battery charger up? Because it's positive ground. Do I put the positive lead on the starter side and then put the ground on whatever's grounded? Or how do I do it? Well, here's how you do it. You hook the leads up the way the battery is, positive and negative. This is the positive terminal on the battery There, you can see the plus. That's the positive terminal, but that's the ground. That's grounded right here. This is a positive grounded tractor. So that's a positive. That's a negative. That goes to the starter, that one there. But whenever you're charging it, whenever you're jumping it, you hook positive to positive, negative to negative. Doesn't matter where the lead goes to. Because you can charge a battery backwards. I've seen it done. And it just ruins a battery. You get, you get them charged where that becomes your positive side, this becomes your negative on the battery. You can charge, if they're clear, clear dead. Now, if they're not clear dead, you won't, I've never seen them charge backwards when they weren't clear dead, but it makes the battery, I've seen the batteries get hot because you're, you technically you're shorting the battery out. Um, but, uh, it, Positive to positive, negative to negative, regardless of what's grounded when you're going straight to the battery. Now, I can move this positively down here onto the ground, and it still will charge because this wire is connected. So I could put this positive lead anywhere. I could put this, this, lead, this negative lead here over on the starter, and it would still charge just the same. But I don't dare put that positive lead on the starter and a negative lead on the ground down here. And now you're charging backwards. You'll, you'll ruin your battery, probably burn up your, your uh, battery charger. I don't know if this one has a, a, a thing in it to tell you. This has no light. This is, this is old school right here. I've had that thing for 30, 40 years, 40 years, maybe more. Anyway, there's no, uh, tells you if you're backwards on your ground or anything like that, if you're hooked up backwards or anything. So, but that's how you do it. Just positive to positive, negative to negative, regardless of where the batteries or where the battery leads go to. Positive terminal to positive terminal, negative terminal to negative terminal. I think I've said it enough times. Um... If you have multiple batteries in series, where you have two 12 volt batteries, but you're still doing 12 volts, you go positive to positive on one battery and negative to negative on, I always do it on the same battery. If you have, let's see, no, that's in parallel, parallel, where you have two batteries, but you're still, I don't care if it's two six volt batteries, if it's two 12 volt batteries, if it's two eight volt batteries, um, as long as you're, you're always keeping positive lead to positive lead on the other battery and negative lead or terminal to negative lead or terminal on the other, you know, on the other post on the other battery, that's how you charge them. Now, if you got 24 volts, which means this positive lead would go to the negative lead on the next battery and that negative lead would go to the positive lead on that battery. I always use my first set of batteries, and I go positive to positive, negative to negative, and it'll charge the other battery a lot slower because now you're charging 24 volts, with it, unless you got a 24 volt charger. But it'll still charge that way, and you won't affect you won't affect anything. It's no different than charging a single 12 volt battery. It's just taking more amps to charge everything up. That'll work, but you don't you don't dare put. No, I said that wrong. I just said that wrong. You go positive lead to negative lead. So your positive goes on this and negative lead to positive lead. So your negative lead 
Let's see. Yeah, this goes on the positive lead. Yeah, that goes, no, I said it, right? That goes on the negative lead. That still goes on the negative lead, no matter what. Yeah, it still goes on. I said that, right? I don't have one in front of me to look at, so I'm doing this from memory. My memory ain't too good anymore. But that's how you do a 24-volt. Still, positive, positive, negative, negative, regardless of what the second battery is doing. And, and that will charge them up for you. Um, just take a lot longer on 24 volts. But I hope this helps somebody out. Helps somebody out. Hope you um, understand what I'm saying here. If you have any questions, put it in the comments below. You know, and again, positive comments are always welcome. If you're going to be a, be an a-hole about stuff or jackwad, I, mind your own business. Just move on. Don't waste your time in mine because I'm going to delete your comment anyway. Ta. So you can do what you want. It ain't going to show up anyhow. So there you go. Um, again, hope this helps somebody out. Thanks for watching. God bless.